Hi, I'm Scott David. Hello. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. My name is Ali Abdullah. I come from uh, DFT. I want to ask some question about uh, uh, tolerance. Okay. What do you think about uh, tolerance? I think. Yeah. What do you think about tolerance? Excellent. I think that globally we're entering into uh, a new era of tolerance. I think all around the world, uh, some people's feelings have changed about how we view others. I think that uh, in order to be tolerant of other cultures, of other uh, religions, that we need to understand one another better. And I think we're entering into a, a new era of tolerance. I think the, the, uh, the evidence of that is uh, certainly seen in the United States where they've elected a black president, a black man as president for the first time, uh, a man whose uh, father was uh, African and Muslim, who gave him the name uh, Barack Hussein Obama. I think the idea that the American populace uh, and the American nation being able to uh, make that kind of a leap and get out of the frame that they were in before uh, has, a, has a big impact on the world and I, I think that's a, a nice um, uh, test to see how things are going as far as tolerance. Um, I believe we still have a lot of uh, a lot of work to do and I think it's I think it's important that we ask questions and get to know one another on a, on a much uh, deeper level. Uh, to learn about other cultures and to learn about other other faiths. And uh, do you have uh, tolerance in your country? In Canada, we do have uh, a great deal of tolerance. Uh, Canada is made up of so many different nations and so many different beliefs and faiths. Um, but again, I think it's something that we need to be working on all the time. It's not as though we can relax and say we have enough tolerance. It's a, it's a daily thing, a day-to-day -day thing that we need to um, educate people and educate others uh, about having respect for other people and respect for their uh, their beliefs and what they what they hold dear, what's what's important to them in their values and uh, their beliefs. Okay, thanks, Mr. David. You're very welcome. Okay. Thank you.